What up YouTube? It's time for another Motorsport Manager video. And instead of telling you what's going on, I thought I'd show you. This is a trailer made for Motorsport Manager made by Gween Alien. And I think you're really gonna like it. Rises on a new season. The sun rises on a new season of Formula 3. Teams scramble to find their footing in the new inhospitable climate of the racing scene. As the sun scorches the rubber on the racetrack, all who gather begin to hear the chant of a team long thought to have breathed its Winners last breath. Off. As the message is delivered, fear ripples through the ranks of F3. Ozu Racing flees back to F2. Racers retire, and the once great Falco runs weeping for the bag, <laughs> no longer able to keep up. For now, Golden Tiger's horsemen have mounted and signal the apocalypse for all who try to oppose. Flying with fresh tires, the Portuguese prodigy plays her part to perforate and pull apart the competition. Rafaela Moraes, the newest acquisition of the company, proves to the world that there are only three stats that matter in a driver. At her side, the most fearsome phenom on four wheels to ever grace the hallowed halls of motor sport. Anthony Joseph, once in the shadow of the traitor Engelhart, now stands atop the corpse of his career to raise trophies higher in the air. Their leader, Staniel Herbert, returns from battle to fight a war of a different variety. He signs his renewed contract with the blood of Valorant pros and sets his sights for manager of the season yet again. There is no running. There is no hiding. There is only racing. And that means it's already been won. GG WP. Winners Pov Esports. Sheesh, ladies and gentlemen, insane. It's time to play a little motorsports manager. And with that inspiring me, there is nothing that can hold me back from finally fulfilling on my promise and qualifying for F2. Oh, we're so close. We're so close. <sighs> Let's do it. Let's do it. <laughs> Did Midnight change the game, the title? Are we feeling good? Are we ready to go? Or does Peepaw have to do it himself? <sighs> Got my iron brew. And I'm ready to go. All right, first things first. I don't know if we changed the pit crew. In fact, I'm pretty sure we didn't. So let's remove the fatigued crew. And then we'll twerk around a little bit here. Mm -mm. I'm sure there is something better we can do. There's just so many optimizations that are quite easy. I don't know why the game would do me like this. Like, this is just better for both. Good for the goose and good for the gander, I would say. Oh, but refueling is so important. We'll do that. Yes, sir. All right, and our highest mistake chance is 0. 0.9. 0. 0.9 kind of cringe. That's fine. That's fine. I buy my Iron Brew on Amazon. I think it was a little flatter than it should be, but it still tastes good. Great. Now, we have $2.5 million in the bank. And we have six races to do. Which means we're going <laughs> negative in money. Unless we bank the most nasty sponsors. Which is possible. Our marketability is only good enough for two stars. Ah, I wish we had slightly better marketability. Maybe a marketable reserve driver? Ah, I have not done a race today. This will be the first one. We are, oh, we spent all our money on the Handling Development Center, which was insane for me. We we already did Tondela. We did great. It's Next up is Munich, and the problem is suspension is really important, and we do not have good suspension. If we were looking, for example, at our parts chat, we have the best brakes, the best engine, and very, very bad gearboxes and suspension. Actually, our suspension isn't that bad. Why does it think it's that bad? Oh, I guess it is. <laughs> hey, I guess it is. Shit. Okay, yeah, we'll try and get to first in the standings for the marketability. I think we're close. I think we're, what, third, fourth in drivers? Which I know how to check. 
Oh, we're second fourth. Nice. Oh, we're only two points off. It would be sick to get some marketability. In fact, if we win this race, go up to first in drivers, he'll be more AJ will be more marketable and maybe we can bink a better sponsor. Yeah, they've been dumping cash into suspension because it wasn't stock. The gearbox was stock last season. Oh. The problem is I just don't think there's a good suspension for us. 318, huh? It just seems terrible. <laughs> it actually just seems terrible. <laughs> During qualifying. This, yeah, this sucks. We have to go with no suspension. Uh, AJ's 19 years old? That can't be true. Can it be? No, AJ's 23. We're fine. 19 what? Rafa's 20. Oh, Falco. Yeah, Falco's 19th in drivers. Yeah, Falco sucks, dude. He's cringe. He boomed us. AJ can get driver's championship. We just have to deal with Shaw from Lucatelli. Shaw is actually the thorn in our side and has insane power. The problem is his breaking and cornering. Which means if Shaw is in the lead, not that good. Because overtaking is huge. But the smoothness stat combined with some of the other stuff he does lets him go long on these softs. Oh, it's so tough. Our drivers are 8th now, not 10th. That's good. Yeah, he has not. He did not run mediums a single time last race, which was so tough for us. Fix the car real quick. The question is... Oh, the question is, can we build more parts? How much money do we spend each race? 1.1, we can't. We actually cannot build parts for now. We have to chill until we bink a better sponsor. Which means... We throw everything into this engine so that we can use it and we just start improving shit, <laughs> right? That's just how it goes. <laughs> the illegal suspension. Oh, I hope I don't have to use, I don't hope I don't lose the illegal suspension soon. <laughs> we'll see. Yeah, if we want to do illegal parts, we'll just do it later in the season. I could request money once the chairman is happier. Good thinking, good thinking. It's going to be close. I think that's only like 2 million bucks, though. <sighs> Cavalcanti not only destroyed F3, looks to be destroying F2. Team Kirov was such a fucking joke. Or it wasn't even Kirov at the time. Did she move teams? She's a fucking jamoker. Too good for my league. You missed an insane trailer, Gary. But other than that, just chilling. Okay, reliability work done. I probably did a little too much. Refueling on the way out in 2021? <gasps> One potential downside of removing refueling would be a lessening of strategic choices. Currently, managers are able to under or over fuel cars, and this change would remove one weapon from their arsenal. Interesting. I lose a lot in the pits. Very. Oh, no, pause, pause, pause. Fuck, I forgot to change the car. Cringe. I'm cranking. Oh, it, it automatically switches it to 20. That's amazing. That is very good for us. Let's just keep improving things, you know? Just just doing our thing here. All right, Munich has a 40% chance of rain. That is so cringe for me. A lot of pressure is placed on the brakes, and we have the best braking system around. Hell yeah. The problem is I think that medium speed corners are also important. It's Anthony's birthday. Should we get him a nice present? Yeah, of course. Of course. $100,000 is nothing for my king. Car feedback. Hi, boss. When you compare it to the rest of the European racing series, our car is average at best. You can't expect me to put in my best performances ever when I'm working with inferior material. I know we can do better. Maybe we can design a few new parts or make some improvements to the one we already have? Yeah, we're working on it. We are, in fact, working on it. <laughs> Pre-race gossip. Winners Pop Racing are... Oh, here we go. Shaw's lead over Joseph at the top of the championship stands at two points. And the Winners Pop Racing man is hoping to cut that gap down this weekend, he told the press gallery. I'm coming for Shaw. 
it's only a matter of time. And then Winter's Paw Racing are likely to struggle this weekend, with this being one of the less favorable tracks on the calendar for the United States-based outfit. Munich was never going to be our strongest race of the season, to be honest. It's not going to be easy, said AJ. Damn, that's tough. Ooh, maybe we change what we want to do. I think we want to keep refueling. I don't want to make the game too simple. So I'm going to go against it. How many votes do I have? Five? I'm going to put two votes against the refueling ban. We are coming for Shaw. Oh my god, I didn't need to do two votes. Yeah, we don't want to make it boring. Sick. And I still have enough votes that I can push something later. Yeah, I've said that for four seasons though. It's not going to matter. I won't be here next year. <laughs> so I do feel kind of bad about that. Our car is up to sixth. That's something. Take a sponsor. I think we're not going to get second because we're bad at this race. It sucks, but we're going to pick ninth or above. B happy and delight. Oh, that's because she had the Tondela car. I kind of want to change it. <laughs> I kind of want to give AJ the fucking juice again. Happy, delighted. Okay, he now has a disgusting engine with... Oh, they both have good fuel. This is great for us. All right, we give him the gearbox as well. Delighted, content. Oh, sorry, that one's better. And then... Delighted, happy. We've done it. And now AJ should actually go nuts. I think AJ should go nuts here. And we've even improved some parts, so... Hmm... The question will be how well we can do. Illegal suspension on AJ? Yeah, I do. I think I do. I could be wrong. <laughs> we'll see, though. Losing two spots? The problem is, it's already a bad race for us. Ugh. The problem is I can't make any better suspensions. God, the suspensions perks suck this year. It's too much risk. Too much risk. Yeah, the lower sponsor target is fine, but I want the driver's championship for more marketing, really. She gives more feedback, but I don't know how important that is. Uh, going out on inters is great to save tires. Where are we at? Are we on? Mu are we in Munich? I hope we are, because <laughs> I'm not changing it. Any Munichers? <laughs> Perfect. It says track name in top right. Where? Or do you have to do this? Oh, when you hit load? Yeah, Munich track A. Perfect. Fantastic. All right, let's get it going. I don't necessarily want inter knowledge, but I do want track knowledge. I want, um, what do you call it? God, why am I so stupid? <laughs> race trim. Thank you. I want race trim and I kind of want to scam it. See how we can do it. Maybe we leave AJ out and scam it with Rafa. Oh, this is so hard. Or maybe she can get quality trim all by herself. This is a gambit and a half. Let's go for it. Maybe we don't scambit at all. Hopefully the save knowledge will get us to at least like goods. They don't use real tracks in this because they didn't get a license. Arrow's feeling great. Handling feels awesome. Amazing. It's still raining. Stay on enters, I guess. Enter one. Race trim one. I think we actually pit Joseph. And we get him on quality trim. Beautiful. We got him in right on time. We have two greats and a good. 
Rain is here. I think the rain is going to go away, but not for long. Do we go for more inter-knowledge? Or do we try and get soft knowledge on this? Let's go for it. Low fuel. She's going to have to come in. Excellent. Okay, excellent. Sick. Uh, she goes out. I don't want her to boom her softs. But it is dry. I guess she goes out on mediums. And we don't care. Quality trim. Three laps. Just to get it to number one. Which I think is possible. Oh, I didn't even change her. Uh, did I not change his setup? Whoops. <laughs> I was not paying attention. Okay. Let's try that direction. Hope his setup isn't bad. Handling is superb. Amazing. Imagine we get soft knowledge here. <gasps> yes. Yes. Okay, quality trim one. And race trim one. That's all we're going to get. The question is, do we get soft knowledge? No, no. Or soft one? Oh, we got soft one. Oh, that's cool. If there's no rain, this is amazing. If there's no rain, we have 5% quality, 5% softs. Combo. Hopefully we tweak his car the right direction. AJ hit six purples in a row. Yeah, I mean, he was running... Uh, the track was drying and he was running softs. So I think that's pretty calm, uh, pretty easy. Hmm. I think we immediately send on inters and then see what we can do. Fuck. I'm going to grab inter trim. Just in case it doesn't stop raining. Oh, this might be a throw. We'll see. Let's just test this. Could be worse. Full send on enters. Although if it rains during the race, we might have an issue. Oh, I went the wrong direction here. Perfect. Good to know. This is okay. Let's try that. This is ERS. This is ERS, baby. We're going to full send both of them immediately. Send out. Because the rain. Maybe it'll dry up later. That would be good for us. If only we had the weather center. But we don't. Did she come out in front? No, he's faster. He should boomer with the better car. <laughs> you got 10 weather setters on here. Come on. Come on. Oh, Rafa. Rafa, you're cringing me. Rain comes back. Okay, it looks like it's going to rain the whole time. I think this could be good for us. Joseph is actually getting boomed. I thought I sent him out first, which would have been fine here. <laughs> here he goes. Alright, he finally got past her. Perfect overheated. They're going to get in his way a little bit too. <laughs> is she going to pass him? Some people are doing it on softs? No way. Do you think they caught that window? No, they couldn't have, because I was the first one out. Wait, Shenshi Shen Shi had a time? How did she go out so quick? I insta sent. This is the first race of the day, yeah. Okay, AJ double uh, purples. 
That's from practice? Oh, I didn't... I, for some reason, I never noticed that. Oh, he lost a purple from, to Saputo. Didn't lose the Sector 1, though. We'll see what Saputo does here. We could lose it right now if he goes double purple. Nice. All right, if it continues raining... Oh, there might be a window right at the end. <gasps> We're going to try and bink softs on the window. None of the softs should beat us. Yeah, they're way off. It's just too wet. But if we bink the soft scam here, we should also get one, two. We should get one, two either way. Because we already got the fastest wet lap. I'm wet just thinking about it. Thank you, Styles. Tell your friends about that video, dude. YouTube is not recommending the Pokemon one to people. Probably because I have Trump and Joseph Biden in the thumbnail. 128. They have to actually get going pretty fast. I don't want to cringe myself here. 96 is great. She's going to go out on softs. This might cringe her a tiny bit, but that's okay. It's a decently long pit lane. Rain is gone. Drying up. All right, go for a king. Ooh, I got worse. We binked a great here. Ugh. This was good. This was good. This was okay. Let's do that. That was great. That was great. Oh, I just never changed it for him. <laughs> so funny. I never moved it. No, I moved it once. <laughs> I'm, I'm actually fucking insane. That was good. Okay, this is fine. Sorry, my brain wasn't working for a second. Oh, this should be a one-two. I'm going to boom another set of softs for this. It should dry up perfectly for Joseph. The question is, is anyone else going to get a lap? Why do you need the 1-2? Dude, the 1-2 is awesome. You get clean air to start. Yeah, there's a chance the high overtake skill helps them, like, go with each other. <laughs> but I'm not sure. All right, yeah, track is very dry. Nice. I think we got it. She starts her flying lap. He has a minute to get past the start. So only a few people are going to get another flying lap for a second time. I think we're almost guaranteed one, two. Maybe some of these other people. Fresh enters is insane. Perfect. Yeah, Rafa's pinking on these softs. And AJ's going to take that from her for sure. AJ's got the better car. We, we gave him the Ferrari. Maybe a bad term because Ferrari not that fast in the last couple of years. Yep. All right, free one, two. Let's go. Let's go. Winner's Pop is getting managed this year. I'll tell you that much. Elsa Dot got out. Yeah, but he's not going to pink. Huge one, two. Oh, Shaw down in 14th. Crazy. Uh, pole position is big for us. It's two more points. Shaw's going to go from 14th to 2nd in like the first lap though. So don't even worry about it. Yeah, he's half a second faster than Rafa. And a second and a half faster than Lee. Who did it on Inters? Oh! Elsa Dot, you animal! Okay, never mind. He fucking split the uprights there on us. 1-3. <laughs> He's a beast. Oh, oh, Santori almost got it. Four tenths off. Hey, 
El Sadat, the Max Verstappen of F3. Something like that. Something like that. Winners Pop Racing's Anthony Joseph has put himself on pole for tomorrow's Munich GP with a blistering lap time of 128. Following close behind were Archer BMR's Mustafa El Sadat and Rafa Moraes of Winners Pop Racing. Will Joseph looking in ominous form? With Joseph looking in ominous form, the chase is on for the rest of the pack. Will they be able to hunt him down? We'll find out tomorrow. Tasty Timbit, thank you for the 11 months. You watched the F1 documentary? Hell yeah, which one? There's some good ones. All right, we only need to get ninth. This should be free. I'm, my goal is to win the race. How's wait? How's the weather looking? I'm gonna make the call with my weather center. This is a dry race. This race is so dry, like Ben Shapiro's wife. Unbelievably dry. Yeah, AJ gonna start mediums. Car setup. This is good. We're not gonna. If it ain't broke, don't fix it, you know? Oh, we didn't change his tires, though. My bad. We do want him to start on mediums. I think. Yeah. Yep, yep, yep. He's also got pole, so maybe he can cover for a minute. 10 laps of fuel. Wait, is this a short race? Twenty-five laps. Ooh. Interesting. I mean, we only have one fresh set of uh, softs anyway. Uh, I think I still need Nurse for right now. Yeah. Santori's got a dodgy neck. That's huge for us. Can't one-stop it, no. All right, let's go, Joseph. Decent start. Oh, great start for Rafa. Oh, she immediately loses it, though. Oh, she's fighting. Yo, she took first. Okay. She says he's on mediums. I can take him all day. Oh, never mind. Oh, ban maps for trees. Ban maps for trees. And they both have fuel efficiency now. Something to keep in mind. Shaw in ninth. Yeah, 10th now, but I'm telling you, that car is a monster. You have to be careful. All right. The biggest thing to worry about is the tire temperature on Rafa and when we back off on Joseph. Yeah, Rafa took second and is starting to gap a little bit. That's huge for us. Joseph winning after two laps on mediums is a very good sign. Yeah, looking like Cavalcanti. Uh, although we're doing not as much of a gap. Actually, <laughs> pretty, pretty monstrous. Back off on fuel a little bit. Yeah, scrutineering could be an issue. <sighs> nice. Fastest lap on mediums. And a full tank of gas. God damn. Once there's grip on the track and we get those softs on at the end, we should boom fastest lap. Yeah, we were pushing fuel uh, when he got fastest lap, to be fair. Oh, they're using team orders. Oh, they're letting Shaw go. Shaw's up to sixth. Oh, no. F Surge, thank you for the four months. Yeah, I actually played... If you want to see me play Elden Ring, I put out a YouTube video a couple days ago. Elden Ring, but the video ends when I rage. I think you'd really like it. Dude, what? Both of us with no suspensions. We're gapping the entire field. What the fuck is happening right now? Holy shit. 
Is Elsa not holding up? Shaw's up to fourth. Shaw's the one we gotta worry about. No, supposedly this is a brakes and suspension heavy race. We do have the best brakes, but we do not have the best suspension. First race of the day, yeah. Thank God we built the um, the testing track, huh, Memes? Thank God we built the testing track, little kitty. Thank God. Okay. She's going to go four more laps. He's going to go five more laps. This is fine. She can continue pushing fuel for a little bit. Oh, my God. This is the biggest gap we've ever had in a 1-2. Shaw is in third, though, and Bronlick is in fourth. So that's the team that could gain on us now that they got through traffic. I think she can still push for a little bit longer. She needs to have three when she hits the finish line. And he can push a little bit because he's not going to have 11. He needs to have four when he hits the finish line. Tires looking good on both. Can probably push his tires a little more. Can definitely push her tires a lot more. Shaw does have super overtake mode, which could be an issue for us. This is fine. This is fine. Uh, I'm actually worried about tire heat. Yeah, the gap is insane. If we don't fuck up anything, like in the pits, this is crazy. But remember, Shaw charged through the field. What's going to help us is Joseph going long and Shaw on softs. He's on, like, the, the Rafa line. So far, this has been our easiest race, yeah. 3-4 is both Lucatelli, but if we get 1-2 and they get 3-4, that's a recipe to win constructors. Insane that I could have maybe taken the better sponsor. <laughs> Shaw can triple soft every race, and that is a worry for us. Put some heat in those tires. Kind of worried about these tires now. Although she only has to do one more lap. Oh yeah, he did use a pair in quali. Okay, Rafa's going to send it on this next lap. 33%. Yeah, this should be fine. I think this is well-managed. Well-managed tires, well-managed everything. Okay. Well-managed motorsport. True. True. Oh, we grab the mediums for her. Fill her up. Any parts need to be fixed? No. We're going to go fast pit strategy. Keep an eye on her fuel. We're going to have to back off for a second. Mellow in seventh with hards. Yeah. Some of them are crazy. Winner's paw of the W stands for well managed. <laughs> All right. Keep an eye on. Although the pit lane's pretty early. We might just be able to leave her on. She does have better fuel efficiency because of the en that engine. All right, she's pitting. And Big Dog is going to full send it for one more lap and then pit. for another pair of mediums. And we might have to stretch these a tiny bit. Tough. And then we'll go low fuel on softs at the end. Ooh. I had one second to fix the brakes here, so we don't do it. Good pit. Good pit. And she comes out in 11th. That's great. Because these people have to pit. 
Yo, she might actually make up some distance. Shaw, the smoothest king, stretching through softs. He must be pitting here, right? Yeah, he's pitting as well. Okay, so we'll come out in front of him. Bromlick has to do a drive through. Oh, that's so good for us. Six. Good tire management on the homie. Actually, great tire management on Joseph, too. Both of them did a great job. Could have pushed tires slightly sooner, but like we're talking half a lap. No mistakes. No rushing. Coming out of the pits. We might need to chill on this so we can get to those softs. That's what we have to worry about. Joseph comes out in second behind Vales. Vales. Who's behind? McPhail, Jupalauma, and then Braunlich, who has served his penalty. Yeah, second after a pit is kind of bonkers. And first is pitting, so we'll be back to first. And third is pitting. We'll be back to first with clean air. The question is, where did Shaw come out? Seventh? But on another pair of softs. You fucking animal. You fucking animal, dude. That's crazy. The award show is the 12th. Six days from now. After that penalty, Bronlick is basically dead last. Tell that to Falco, baby. Tell that to fucking Falco. Alright, here we go. Clean air. We're back in the 1-2. With separate strategies, we made it back to the 1-2. That's huge for us. Okay. Yeah, six seconds. She has six seconds on um, Shaw, which is more than she did before the pit. Suspension could boom us, but that would just make us first third, Consider if we hold this, which we're not guaranteed to do. Braun the 18th, told you. <laughs> Falco, man. Falco, Falco, Falco. Uh, clean air is a thing in real F1. I have no idea if it's a thing in this game. I mean, it should be. Dude, AJ is flying. Holy shit. Yeah, looking like Batista last year, actually. It's nice seeing the gold on the minimap. I think they are slowed down when someone is in front of them slowing down. So, I think it would be good. He does get the racing line every time instead of having to defend. In real F1, you want clean air instead of turbulent air. You get turbulent air if you're behind another car because the air is coming off their car. The cars are designed for clean air. Like, the fastest an F1 car will go is right uh, is on its own. At least in the turns and stuff like that. There's, there's some weirdness to it because obviously you can draft a little bit. I'm not a scientist. Yeah, the drone camera on the minimap is sick. Keep our eyes open. This is the first race of the day. Fuck, dude. Shaw is actually going nuts on those softs. <laughs> it's going to be up to Rafa. Yeah, Dirty Air creates a massive amount of loss in downforce. Shaw is on his last pair of softs, and we will be putting on softs at the end. Yeah, obviously DRS, uh, the drag reduction system chat, is when you're within a second of someone in a DRS zone, you can drop the flap so the air goes right through it, and all of a sudden your car fucking scoots. It's very cool. Might have to push more Shaw's catching. Yeah, but we are not booming our tires at all. Oh, he's full conserving on softs. Damn, he's catching with full conservation. I don't know if there's DRS in the game. Uh, I haven't been in F1. There you go. That's the way I learned it. Is on corners you want clean air, but on a straight you like the slipstream. There isn't in this game? Got it. That kind of sucks because it's really interesting. 
or the uh, not the DRS, but the one the charging the battery and then just going into like overtake mode. She's got 3.3 on him. We'll keep our eyes open. ERS is a thing in this game? Okay, sick. Oh. 3.2, 3.1. Is Shaw getting slowly gapped? Shaw is getting gapped by Joseph. I, he's not getting gapped by Mor uh, Rafa. Rafa is losing tents uh, because he started pushing his tires. But the good news is she can actually push her tires. She has enough juice. But we want her to at least get some mediums. 53%. She can definitely push tires. So can he. Hopefully we'll get some of those tents back. Yeah, it's already going up. He went back to conserving, but pushing fuel. He's a psycho. An actual psycho. He's going to get three laps. Ooh. She is also going to get three laps? Does he need to conserve? I don't want to stack. She's going to get two laps. Start pushing. This is his last set of softs. But he's still fast on mediums. He's just fast. Shaw's fast, dude. Just like Joseph. Okay, he can push a little bit here. Are you going to do some S-Fan level pre postseason green screen commentary? Dude, is S-Fan ever going to do the stands roll... S fan could never. It actually insane. Come on, come on. Pfft. I like S fan, but you guys have no idea. <laughs> okay, we back off in three, two, one. She pits this lap. We grab the softs, fuel options. There will be eight laps remaining. Uh, she can push, so we might grab the whole ten laps. It would also allow us to fix one part for free. Oh, no, for one second. We're not going to do that. Like small spoons. Thank you for the prime. High risk. Got to do it. Full push on both. Great. Wait, no. Joseph still does need to push. I wasn't paying attention, right? Dude, Joseph is so far in front of everyone. This is insane. We have never had a race like this. We're basically just managing Rafa, <laughs> trying to make sure that she can do okay. Would love if we can get the full two laps off this. On hot tires? I think he can. The illegal suspension is only like 30 better, isn't it? Am I crazy? Okay, yeah, he's going to go in the extra one. The extra mile for the softs. This is the first race of the day. All right, she's out on softs. Let's go, baby. Stay on overtake mode. Push, push. Uh, they do fix place penalties. If Joseph, no matter how far ahead he is, if he gets bu uh, bum bumped, he will get third. I believe I have fastest lap right now. Which is very good for us. Yep. AJ still has fastest lap from earlier. And he should only go faster. Right now we have max points for the race if we don't get scrutinized. Pole position, fastest lap, 1-2 finish. AJ does have an illegal suspension that has not been caught. Yeah, if I was a real life scrutineer, I would definitely check right now, you know? <laughs> it's like, what the fuck, dude? You're insane. Yeah, but AJ, would go, we would get first third instead of first second. If Rafa continues on. Which I think she will. I know you want to pit for fresh tires. Wait, did we not tell him to pit? <laughs> Holy shit, we almost did it again. We almost did it again. That would be so funny. <laughs> it always rounds up. Okay, great. Ooh, parts might be an issue. 
Don't care. Lamau. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Dude, look how far ahead he is. He's gonna come out in first. He's gonna come out in first, man. Maybe. He did save me, yeah. He's a homie. Yeah, Pickrew has been doing great. All right, we're back in one, two. Shaw's behind us, but he's on mediums now. The biggest thing will be making sure Rafa can make it to the end on these softs. Yeah, he does have super overtake. Super overtake on these mediums and a full tank of gas could be bad. Okay, so AJ basically won the race. Let's just, <laughs> let's manage from the back. She's up 2.6. He is pushing hard. Fuck. Yeah, we missed out a on a lot from the sponsor. But, I mean, everyone in the interviews was saying this is not the race for our car. And I believe them. Okay, halfway through this lap, we're going to have to turn her back to regular, I think. Just to be sure. I would hate to get boomed on something stupid like fuel. I think she's good for the rest of the race, but again, we do not want to get boomed. She has fuel efficient engine, which is huge. She just needs four laps when she gets to right here. Ah, oh, she does have more than enough. Oh. I would just feel so stupid. She just needs four when she gets to right here. She has 4.6. Uh, we're actually keeping the gap on Shaw. 2.5. This is huge for us. Yeah, if Rafa stays in second, we secure first, even if uh, he gets caught. Correct. Need to have three when we get to right here. Dude, these engines are kind of nasty. These engines with the fuel efficiency are kind of nasty. Bromlick out of the points. Huge for constructors. 2.4. We're still keeping it around the same. We lost a tenth this lap. But I think we might gain it on the straight. Two tenths. She needs three. Fastest lap again. Good stuff on the softs. How close are we to blue flagging Falco? We're actually not that close. <laughs> like half a minute, 30 seconds. Dude, we are we are going to lose this gap. Oh, it's all going to be about Rafa. Uh, she can start pushing tires. Uh, I think you still get... Yeah, you still get fastest lap if you get scrutinied. Suspension braking. Don't worry about it, King. Still 2.5, actually. You know what? This isn't bad. We're only one illegal part low. Low illegal. Yeah, if we give her the busted suspension, she might be able to hold better. Oh my god, AJ's just purpling literally everything. All right. Mm -hmm. 
to. We might be able to go a little red right at the end, but not much. 3.2. Oh, she's gapping. She's gapping, baby. Her favorite clothing store is the gap. AJ Fuel? No, he's fine. He's fine. He's got super duper fuel efficient on sauce, doesn't he? And even if he ran out, he would still coast to victory. <laughs> Gap is down to three. We're not going to boom tires, right? No, 26%. They go bad at 10. That's first. No scrutineers. Come on. What a race. What a fucking race for winners, Pav. That's what I'm talking about. Pole, fastest lap, one, two. And one of the drivers for Lupidelli, whatever their name is, Lucatelli, didn't even get points. Yeah, Bronlick 11 is massive. That uh, pit drive through he had, he would have had at least eighth, right? Lost so much time. Hey, he's only six seconds off that. Oh, 0.09 fuel, that's a rising star maneuver. Yeah, 0.07 on the other one too. Could have pushed his tires earlier. That was a mistake. Nice. Please, please, no scrutineers. Can I pay him money to look away? Come on, come on, come on. This is going to be important, chat. Well, yeah, but he could have had a bigger lead. We want to play perfectly. Yes! That's what I'm talking about, baby. Stellar management. That is a clean one-two. Pole position, fastest lap. You cannot get more points than that. Yes! Hell yeah! Woo! Easy one-two. Look at that. That's 22 points. That's 22 points. Falco's never even sniffed 22 points. All right, AJ solidly in first for drivers. Rafa in third, but a pretty big gap. 14 to second. Constructors, all of a sudden we've opened up the gap to 17. Let's go. Can we get constructors, drivers, and promote? Oh, that would be so sick. We might be able to take some more chairman money too. Joseph was definitely pushed to his limits during the race in Munich. Pulling off a number of daring overtaking maneuvers literally didn't overtake anyone. The winner's pod racing driver eventually came out on top with Morais finishing second and Shaw rounding out the podium. Winning winner's pod racing boss Daniel Herbert collected the team's trophy and looked delighted as he downed the champagne. That's another W for your boy. He was pulling right end to end. Yeah, maybe after he pit the first time he passed one person, but no, that was easy. That was easy. Does the risk of crashing go up with harder tire slash engine push? Um, only if it's really worn or if you're breaking apart. Ooh, Rafa's cornering is about to go up to 10. That's huge for us. I also think AJ's overtaking getting to 19, his smoothness going up. All these things are good for him. <gasps> New unlock? <gasps> Pit stop guru tire changes. Tire changes are 50% faster. That's pretty huge. Which might even be better than the 50, the 5% we get. Yes, 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 yes. No, 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 no. <laughs> Ooh, we are losing money. We're going to have to start getting some sponsors. Let's see if our market marketability went, went up. Tires are faster than fuel. Fuel Guru is better, but what are you going to do? All right, AJ's in first. We go look at sponsors. Dude, our marketability is down. Rafa's marketability is literally zero. Fuck. Pole position for Joseph, amazing. Car condition for Rafa didn't drop at all because of Nurse, very well done. Interview with Central Sports Network, yes. Simple question, which one of your drivers is better? AJ. <laughs> Easy peasy. Pit crew review, no mistakes. They did a great job, nice job, pit crew. And a hard fought win. That's big, that's big for us. Car repair complete. I'm gonna do... A little maneuver 
that many people haven't seen. I'm going to take another 1.9 million. I'm going to make a new part. <laughs> I'm going to do it. Should I wait for the HQ though? I might make a second scam. God, we've got the best engine and the best... Wait, what does our second engine look like? Where is our biggest discrepancy between cars? 591, 561. That's fine. Ooh, engine is pretty big. 527, but it's also the most expensive. Gearbox is about a 50-point swing. That's pretty massive as well. Potential 50-point swing at full bore as well. And suspension isn't a big swing at all. So we either make a gearbox or an engine. Gearbox is cheaper. I think we just make a second gearbox right now. Knowing... Oh no, the, the engine is actually so much. For only 500,000 more. The gearbox is kind of cringe, chat, but... For only 500,000 more, we have a delta of... This is maxed. Is this maxed? 540 to 580. Oh, that's only 40. What is the gearbox delta? 211 to 60. Oh, actually, gearbox delta is more. Gearbox delta is more, so that's what we build. The scam box. I don't think we'll make the scam box, though. Acceleration plus to max. Acceleration... What? Ugh, build time down? This is 211. Mm. Mm. I hate that. We could technically add some risk if we wanted to get fucking brazy with it to go to 251. We could also build suspension in case the other one gets banned, but would we run them at the same time? I think a legal gearbox is probably our best play. And the crazy thing is I actually think we don't put a second part on it. <laughs> it gets done so much faster. I think we just make the classy 211 gearbox for a million bucks and it's done super quick. Yeah, that's what we do. You have an empty component slot. I'm going to continue. They don't know me. They don't know my life. Perfect. That will be done quickly and we can work on getting it ready for the next race. It does not unlock the next level knowledge. Great knowledge. I already have good knowledge unlocked there. They just suck. But I don't believe I have the facility to do it anyway. Two greens, but both of them add, um, both of them added risk or took away top speed. So they're just not worth it. The two greens were terrible, chat. Come on. Well, I can't look. It was either add risk or remove top uh, performance. And I don't want to do either of those. Keep up. We definitely want to fix this. This is going well. Were we booming any parts at all? I don't think so. Hmm. I guess we keep using this. Hmm. Throw that in there. We keep it on 20. AJ's brakes did get a little low, but they weren't crazy. We'll keep them on. It'll almost never finish, though. Our performance is going to be maxed very soon, and then we'll just get done on... um Performance work done already? No shit. No shit. Oh my god, we're maxing everything. Throw that in. The second engine will be doing a little bit better here. We can get it done before the race. I think we want to. Got some emails. Club goer. Ooh, that adds marketability. Top ERS driver Rafa Moraes was spotted staggering out of a nightclub at 6 a.m. last night. The bar in question, shoosh, is known to attract some of the world's brightest and most beautiful. Rafa bought the entire bar a round of drinks, said one delighted patron. Others, meanwhile, were less impressed. That bitch was staring at my boyfriend all night. I hope she crashes in her next race. Uh, Rafa's representatives have declined to comment on the story. That's super funny. Okay, that marketing is really great for us, but still not high enough. Unforge. Very unforge. Performance work is complete again? No, that was the first one. No, this, we'll wait to the, for the race for sponsors. <laughs> Cavalcanti is still winning F2. Jeez, what a beast. 
Our car is moving up the grid. It's now the fourth best. Wasn't it just eighth? These extra parts and the performance boost is very good for us. Performance work about to finish right when the gearbox is done. That's perfect for us. Sick. All right. Now let's see if we can get it scammed out in time. Gearbox numero dos. 40%. Max it. Should be good. All right, all of our sponsors are available. Let's check it out. We would like one that's like first or... Oh, no. We wanted one that was like first or better. Oh, shit. Did the song change? Of course it did. I, for I always forget to hit loop. You know me. You know me. Mr. Dingleberry, thank you for the prime. The one year of prime, my friend. I could take the shortest or I could just not do any. This one just sucks ass. This is replacing the first place one, I believe, right? Oh, I can still do second or above. Oh, never mind. We're fine. We'll just take the money. This is fine. First slot always has bad placement. Oh, really? Interesting. Good to know. We got Golden Tiger back. All right. 1.6 up front or 350 a race for nine races or a million up front. For six races, theoretically, we might be able to get more value out of a second sponsor. As crazy as that sounds. But this is, wait, 2.7 million? For nine races. This is the best one. Wait, is it? Am I doing my math right? This is a lot of fucking money. Yeah, it's, it's by far, it's a lot of money. But it is the most races. It's like 3.2. Sick. Yeah, I took off the... F I abstracted the 50 and just did 9 times 3. <laughs> uh, I'll take it. Fuck yeah. It's only one star. What are you gonna do? Ugh. It might come to the point in the season where we have to hire new non-tired pit crew. Which feels fucking bad because my pit crew are kind of nasty. Ah, we hate this. We hate this. What's our mistake chance? Oh, 1% on these two. If I fire the most tired person, it's also the best person. I could fire Rojas. And we could hire for refueling. If we're minimizing mistake chance, this is good. But this person's very flexible. We're firing Rojas. Oh, we don't even need to. Sick. There we go. That should help us out a little bit. Ugh, 1% right here, huh? Yeah, it's still the best for us, though. Oh, unless? I could lose a tiny bit. No, it's not worth it. All right. Alrighty, this will do. Kind of worried about the pit crew. But that's okay for me. Let's keep it moving. We're looking really good on all parts except the suspension. But I believe we're building the suspension building right now. The handling development center, right? This unlocks better suspensions. So next season, we can just fully scam out a new suspension. Mm -mm -mm. Yeah, I hate having so many people on the pit crew. It feels really silly. All right. Once reliability work is complete, we want to check. It should happen before the race, which is great for us. We don't have enough money for another building this season. We actually are going to get two buildings this season. We might get two buildings, a good car, and win the league, which would be amazing for us. We we have more money than we did going into that race. Choosing a vote. Ooh. I mean, the thing is, I shouldn't be in this league next year. I should not be in the league next year. <laughs> Please. Huh. <sighs> Oh, let's just lower the pit. Uh, let's lower the size of the pit crew again. I'm down. 
I hate having so many pit crew because they get tired and I can't hire more. Oh, did I finish the uh, performance or the fixing work? 84% more than good enough. Let's get some performance going. Most important parts to improve. Those are done. Those are done. That one's going. Ugh, I hate working on the scammed one, but that's fine. And then we talked about the brakes maybe breaking a little bit. Or the secondary brake. No, she has nurse for now. But she might not need it. Tough. All right. We're currently in first. It's better. Excellent work. Thank you. Thank you, Chairman. Thank you for not firing me this season. Hmm. I'm going to do three votes for. Fuck it. If I do somehow throw the bag. <laughs> Should have done more. Should have done more. Thanks for no voting, fucking loser. <sighs> I wish there was a way I could talk to him. All right, well, that's cringe. That is, dare I say, Omega cringe. 20% chance of rain. It's a high-speed circuit. It'll suit cars with strong engines. We have the best engine around. Amazing. My assistant tells me we snagged some of the most lucrative sponsorship deals around. The rest of the teams in the European Racing Series are struggling to compete. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. How is our part? How are our parts doing? They are doing very well. I'm good to uh, glad to see it. Financial management concerns. Come on, didn't you see me last season pull a rabbit out of a fucking hat? All right. It's time to travel, ladies and gentlemen, so that no one gets pre-roll and so that I can use the restroom. I'm going to run a quick ad. I will see you all on the other side. What are you biting me for? What are you biting me for? Don't hold my hand. BRB. BRB.
What up? Let's do it. I don't know how we're going to follow up a poll fastest lap one to finish. But you know what? Let's fucking try it. Let's fucking try it, ladies and germs. <sighs> and I think we have to go for the big boy. Interesting. The difference is offset by placing second or first, huh? That's so funny. I pay my drivers a lot of money if we win. <laughs> We are going to swap suspensions. This is going to lose AJ some juice. But it's absolutely worth it. It will ho help Rafa hold off the other team. And... Wait, what is happening here? Oh, we've got a lot of parts to change. We have the second gearbox now. <gasps> what? I'm giving you a better gearbox. Oh, that's why. Scammed. Double scammed. And other than that, I think we're sitting pretty. First race went about as well as a race can go, chat. Very happy with it. I feel like it's brazy bears to use illegal parts in first. I mean, if we get it taken away, we just go down. <laughs> a pretty decent amount of stats. <laughs> Our suspension is dog shit. But that's what we do here. <sighs> Let's do it. I think one of the biggest things we'll need in F2, and I don't know if you can get this from a reserve driver, but paying a ton of money for a high marketability reserve driver might be the play. Because the better sponsorships are just insanely better than like two stars. And if I could start binking four stars, beautiful. Joe Manda, thank you so much for the five months. J Mod, thank you for the 15 months. We're actually getting quite close to the Slothathon. No rain? No rain. I don't know if reserves count towards marketability. Oh, it only comes from two mains? Damn. That's a feels bad, man. I think we just run... Wait, do I have a setup for this? <gasps> I do have a setup for this. That's hype as hell. I'm down to just run hards and try and get race knowledge or whatever. Fuck it. Uh, what was I doing? Race trim. Nine laps. Yeah, we might try a new scam. If I do quality trim three laps, do you think she'll get me quality trim one? Almost assuredly not, huh? Which is why we're going to go race trim nine laps. Get out there, queen. Let's burn these hard tires. Believer's getting hards. Everyone's doing hards, and we're pushing, so we should get... Out of this group, we're easily going to get first second. See? The question is, can we keep it, you know? Yeah, I don't know. I don't think you should ever race on hards in F3, but man, it does feel like there's some juice there. <laughs> if you have 15% extra. Just push the tires the entirety of the way. Okay. This is where we pit Joseph. Oh, we pit them both. Okay. Send out. We'll do the rest of it on softs and try and... I think we can bink quality trim one. I think we could probably bink quality trim one if we do this. Oh, yeah. I always forget to tune the car when I'm scamming nowadays. Good. Great. Excellent. Great. This one's got to move too, though. Not that much. Oh, that's too much. That's too much juice. Oh, wrong way. 
We'll try that. Stints, quality trim, three laps, softs, go. Send her out, tweak the car. Good. Good. Great. Hell yeah. Four minutes. That should be enough for at least one, right? If we can get one soft tires and one quality trim, I think we'll be set for both qualifying and the race. I went the wrong direction. It's okay. That's okay. Yeah, I went race trim. Uh, no, I went. Uh, I did not go race trim. I went double quality trim. Because I'm trying to get quality one. It's going to be close, though. Delta Bear Lines. Thank you for the Raw Dog Tier 1. Okay. Oh, we didn't get a single scam. If we were just slightly faster, if I would have pushed, I could have crossed the finish and done an additional lap. Oh, what a waste of potential. Oh, that's unfortunate as fuck. That would have made the difference. If we had one additional feedback... Oh. <laughs> we just gave up 5% soft tires and 5% quality. Fuck me. The good news is our car is built for this track. Ah, oh, shit. Shit, shit, shit. Oh, and it's... Okay, it's raining. That's good. Oh, not getting the soft feedback is huge here. Let's see if we can weather center scam it. <laughs> we have literally zero perks for this. That's great. That's great. I did go the wrong way on downforce. Uh, I went the wrong way on downforce and the other one. This is good. This is okay. Oh, sorry. This was good. So that much. This one's great. This was good. Great. Good. That's perfect. And then excellent. I'm happy with this. Actually, maybe I can do that. All oh, wrong direction. Yeah, it should be fine. Go out on the enters. Ah, uh, 97%. We don't fuck around with that. We never fuck around with that. Send out Joseph. Great. Send out Rafa. Great. Auto on. Why are believers smoking weed? I'm quick with it. That's what people don't understand. If we can get an interlap and they go out on inters for like a wet lap, that would be so juicy for us. We don't need top four though, we need top two. Doing an outlap in softs, insane. This seems like exactly like the last race. I'm gonna get one two off of just the inter gambit. Oh, I'm losing to Saputo again. Dude, when did Saputo get nasty as fuck? <gasps> Saputo gonna take it from me. Oh, he didn't. He choked in. <laughs> he choked in sector three. Let's go. It does look like the exact same rain as last time. Although this time it's going to stay for enters. Which means maybe I send Joseph around again immediately so that there's no traffic. Interesting. It's still going to be wet, which is perfect for these enters. If he gets out. No, because if you look at it, there's two minutes there. I think you're not going to get a real run in. Mm -hmm. 97%. Fantastic. I think we just do it. I'm not going to hold for softs. I don't think the rain... The weather center is telling me the rain is not going down. Until like the last minute, and I think it's still going to be too wet. Rafa will just try for, like, a bigger window here. Mm -hmm. 
I believe. Ah, shit. Ah, oh, shit. We could have done it. Oh, no. We're going to lose it. Oh, fuck. Uh, it's too late to bring him in. I don't think I can actually get the flying lap done. No, 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 no. Not enough time. Rafa in fourth. Wait, if I bring her in right now, and it takes one minute for a lap, I will try and bring her in. One minute laps. He's way too far gone. She might be able to uh, change. Send out. Softs. Could be good for us. She didn't use two softs in the race, did she? No. Okay, depends on if anyone else is running softs. Rafa's got a minute to get to the finish line and she should get it. AJ might get boomed, actually, yeah. But if Rafa does okay, we'll be fine. Purple, that no one's stealing. Purple, that no one's stealing. Oh, this is a 1 2 with Rafa in first. <laughs> Let's go. Let's go. We still did it. It's just the exact same quality pattern as last time. Woo. That's what I'm talking about, baby. Uh. Sick. Last time we started 1-2, we finished 1-2. I like that. I like that. Shaw 15th. Literally, this is the same race as last time, chat. Shaw went from 14th, I believe, to 2nd in 2 laps. And we have slightly better race trim and pit stop guru for him. It's great. For her, we will take race trim and I think we still take nurse. Uh, she's not going to run hards. Car setup is great. Although, dude, Joseph just likes mediums. Joseph does just like mediums a lot. And we're going to have to use him. Oh, it's a 31 lap race. Oh, maybe we start softs and go soft, medium, medium. Guru does do something for me. This is single seaters. Right? Am I am I crazy, chat? Back up. Oh, I can't. Yeah, it said single seaters, so I'm pretty pretty sure. Do this. It saves like one second versus what hard knowledge, which I'm not going to use. It's great. Because fuel takes longer? Yeah, but... Oh, because they go simultaneously. I see what you're saying. Yeah, fuel is the bottleneck. Kind of pink goddess. Thank you for the prime. But I think it's better than hard knowledge. Mm -mm. I guess I could put hard knowledge on for the off chance that I use it. But I don't think I'm going to use it. She'll start on softs. Boom them immediately. This is great. Attack, 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 attack. Welcome, long-time YouTube watcher, finally watching on Twitch. You'll be excited. <sighs> when are hards used? In F3, I don't believe they should ever be used. <laughs> to be perfectly honest, I think they're a throw. But I have been wrong before. I am keeping up with VCT. I watched the funniest clip of Nade Shot while I was taking a shit right now. Apparently, Hundred Thieves lost to X Set because X Set stuck the bomb, which is so goaty throaty. Rafa outqualified AJ because I, I I did a bad thing. I did a bad boy. But you know what? That happens. Shaw running mediums. He probably boomed his softs in quali. I'll probably play Dicey Dungeons tomorrow. Who knows? I'll play it sometime this week. It's doing well on YouTube. The gaming channel, that is. 
Or maybe even after this, who knows? I like Dicey Dungeons a lot. I need to get some gaming channel videos ready. Yeah, I think if they get Xander or Cryo, or Xander and Cryo, they would easily be top 8. They might still be top 8, but like at the bottom end of that. Who knows? Keep an eye on everything here. I mean, we're just gapping. This is huge. With a 1.6 form, she's four seconds off of the nearest competitor. <laughs> Where's Shaw at? 11. On mediums, huh? This is just a replay of race one, but good for us. Clear weather for the entire race. My finger is saying that, but I'm not sure. Yeah, we're just destroying. We're actually just destroying. Oh, some heat's going to get in that tire. I still plan on doing TFT with Big A or League of Legends with Mango. Although Big A's streaming and he doesn't like to stream TFT, I don't think. I'm not sure. Is Mango live yet? Nah, okay. I might just play some Valorant while I'm chilling, if no one's around. If her form drops to zero, nothing. I mean, form is, I think we've talked about it before, a lagging indicator, I think. Because it doesn't seem like having a 10 out of 10 form means they're going to go nasty. Do I team orders here? No. No, no way. He's on mediums. No way. He's going to back off here too. I mean, team orders for Drivers Championship could be the play. This is race number two of the day. Race number six of the season, I think. Sorry, I had to enter the Mind Palace <laughs> to do math. This would get Rafa to second, yep. But we would also love some breathing room for AJ, just in case something happens, you know? Shaw not passing the people on softs. Yeah, Shaw never starts on mediums. Kind of crazy. He saw Joseph start on mediums and win the race and thought, I got to try that. Yeah, I think we're going to get another pole position fastest lap 1-2 finish. Dude, she's at 0.14. <laughs> she's driving bad and we're still booming them. Does she not like being in first? I didn't think she had that ability. Maybe. Lee is closing the gap. Dude, Lee is... Oh, I was going to say Lee is notorious for triple pitting and he's already pit for hards. The double zero. Yeah, I've never seen that. I, I Again, I don't think form means literally anything in this. Oh, our tires. Oh my god, I didn't even notice. Wait, holy shit. Is this... Are we racing on sandpaper? Maybe I should have taken hard knowledge. Oh my god, I didn't watch anything at all. Seven laps and those are dead? Holy fuck. Oh my god, she's got a pit right now. Damn, even the mediums are getting blown the fuck out. Form hits tires? Yeah. That's crazy. I guess form does do something. Holy shit, that was valueless. What a what a very, very bad stint. Yeah, his tires are getting everyone's pitting early. This track is made of sandpaper, chat. That's what we know. All right, that means we have to push fuel, not push tires. Keep an eye on AJ. Yeah, I pushed a lot of it, but... I stopped before it was even in the heat. I think everyone's going to pit a little earlier than it seems. Yeah, his mediums are better than AJ's. Has he been backing off? I'm not sure. Howdy, Kyber BK. Aloha. Are you in Hawaii? Is that why you're aloha me? 
just finished. We could get three more laps. We're not going to get three more laps with those tires, though. A lot of people are pitting. This track is coarse. Very coarse. There's no way I have to conserve on those. 21%. These go to five. This is the day after the YouTube video. Cards go to zero as well. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah, this is the last lap. Okay. We pit Joseph here. Damn. Hards would have been the right call. That's my bad. I've never seen a track grind up tires like this. Absolute meat grinder. Let's check in on Rafa. Dude, fuel could be an issue, but the problem is tires are also an issue. <laughs> she can go 10 laps on this. Can she go 10 laps on these tires, though? Is the temperature high? No, the temperature's not high. AJ into the pits. Will not be coming out in first, but I don't think it'll be too bad. In fact, if Shaw pits here, which I think Shaw might. Shaw is insane. Going long on my ass. Going long! Wow. You hate to see it. Comes out ninth, right above Rafa. <laughs> but look how fast he just. <gasps> Stacy Gallus crashed! I repeat, Stacy Gallus crashed! All right, but the thing is, everyone's going to pit in front of us. And they're oh, the pro they're slowing us up, though. Joseph needs to overtake these people. Oh, they're holding us up so bad. Oh, no. No, no safety car. Just a yellow. Keep an eye on Shaw. If we're in front of Shaw, we're happy. Yeah, we're both in front of Shaw. Ooh, bad pit for him? That's huge for us. <laughs> Falk slow. <laughs> this should be an easy overtake. Yep. The car is just good now. The car is just good. Stacy Gal is a bit of a mess. Shaw back on mediums. There's a chance that he triple mediums. Which would be so schnutty. I think Rafa gets this as well. Yes, sir. She does. All right. Fifth, sixth. And we're behind people that need to pit. This chat talks about Falco like the right talks about Biden. <laughs> Lazy Falc slow. Can't even show up for the races on time. <laughs> yeah, Rafa 66%. She's got zero form. She's just upset, dude. And I don't know how to... I don't know what to do. Sleepy Falco. Oh... <laughs> the tire temp on AJ? Yeah, we're, we're managed. We're managed well, I think. I am worried about Rafa's tires and the fact that Lee could boom her on a push. But Lee is not pushing. That's good. Rafa did have too much fun at the club. Where'd Shaw go? Seventh? But he's on mediums. Okay. Good to know. Can you tell your chat to stop shit-talking the Winner's Pop legend and my lead driver? Hey, I don't tell the fans what to do. Unless they're being racist or sexist or transphobic or all those other things. Lee does always three-pit. His team is just brain-dead. It's like what they did to Dembele before. Joseph looking good on these hards. Bananan also... <laughs> Bananan was not a three-pitter. It was got the wrong tires always. <laughs> and crashed. <laughs> Falco said he was too good for Winter's Pov and look at him chilling in 18th on ZRT Motorsports. 
<laughs> hey, if Falco's thriving on ZRT, then I don't know what I'm doing. Yeah, Chu and Dembele. Chu raced a couple races this season, I thought. Rafa widening the gap even with her form. Yeah, the problem, though, is... <laughs> we gotta get some heat in these tires. God, the problem is the... <laughs> she's just wearing these tires down. Tough. Seven and a half laps of fuel. This is good. I thought form did nothing, but then she grinded her tires to a pulp in half a lap. And I had never seen anything like that before. Maybe it is adaptability. I don't know. I really don't know. It's crazy. But that's alright. Joseph cruising on these hards. Shaw only up to fifth. This is big for us. The question is, does he throw on softs for that finish? That would be a little bit crazy. Some more laps out of these. Do you think he can start pushing tires? Yeah, Rafa is going to push us, push us close to a three pit. She's going to have to go hard, hards again. Oh, my God. My dog scared the shit out of me. Sophie, all right? Okay. Damn. I forgot she was in here. <laughs> Lee pit. Lee always three pits. That's his thing. Three pit Lee, they call him. Your game seems so slow on normal speed. It's probably because you're not talking to a chat. For me, I'm trying to, like, keep the excitement going, you know? Mm -mm 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 -mm. We're looking good, though. Again, the problem is her tires. This is her last lap, so we push, pull, push orange, and we pit her. Oh, this is actually going to be quite close. Mm -mm -mm -mm. The tires are the issue, not the fuel. She should be fine, actually. The question is, can Joseph get close enough to where mediums make sense? And I think so. Instead of three pitting, they call it Lee pitting. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. Shaw's the smoothest driver on the track. People stay talking about Shaw. Hards do go to zero, yes. Her fuel was her issue. She goes out on hards. Push. Overtake. Alright, get out there, queen. She drops to eight. That's not bad. V1 optic going to map three icebox. Who you got? Ooh, if I finish this race, I might go watch party it. We'll see. There's no games after that, right? There's only two series. 100 Thieves versus X set. Um, on icebox, I have... New icebox, I have V1. I believe in them to adapt. Let's get him to three more laps. Hot take. New icebox. I believe V1 is a team that's got some very good strategies. Oh, it's old patch. Never mind. Never mind. Never mind. I have uh, optic. <laughs> oh, we're about to blue flag someone. Let's go. Let's go, Joseph. I'm not saying that like a Brandon. I'm not saying that like a Biden thing. <laughs> don't, don't get it fucking mixed up. <laughs> I'm actually just saying, let's go, Joseph. I think that AJ is cool. I like him. <laughs> let's go, Joseph. Drift Light, thank you so much for the Prime. I do not need to stay on Yellow Fuel on Rafa. She's got 10 laps of fuel, and we have 9 laps to go. Right? Or no, that's sorry, that's 22. She's on 22. She's got 10 laps to go, and she has exactly 10 laps of fuel. We're still good. Get ready. About halfway through this lap, we take her off. A quarter of the way. Chad, I haven't run out of fuel in literally 20 streams. Chill. Push, push, pit. Push, push, pit. Push, push, pit. Push, push, pit. 
Push, push, pit. Yeah, he got fucked one time. Dude, years ago. Literal years ago. We're going back to back one, two. Don't even worry. Don't even worry. Ooh, exactly eight? Ah, I don't like that. I don't like that at all. No, he couldn't do softs. This track, we're not going to risk softs at all. Yeah, when he when he ran wide, that wasn't my fault though. That was his fault, you know. <laughs> Straight up. I wish she wasn't chewing through tires, dude. Fuck. God, thank you for the eight months. I know I just started watching and I've never seen this game before in my life, but I really think you should tell Joseph to floor it. Joseph, I mean, he's flagging people, dude. He's nasty with it. He would have made it on full send too. You guys are just babies. If Shaw goes soft, he's the goat. He might. Mistake on tires? Good thing we have fast tires. <laughs> it all worked out for us. Coming out in first. Love that. Rafa not making anything up. Which one of you messed up my tires? We can't afford these mistakes. Santa Ana, but she's going to pit. Just he got the softs. He actually has the line. Double medium soft? What the fuck, dude? So insane. Actually so insane. The biggest free thinker we've ever seen. Man. I hope we can go defend these seven seconds. On hards. It's like that scene in Spongebob where Sandy is chasing Spongebob and Patrick and someone gets grabbed. All of a sudden, Shaw is grabbing Elsa Dot. He's grabbing Saputo. He's grabbing Lee. Ooh. <laughs> I mean, there's no universe. <laughs> Joseph just coasts here. Joseph actually just coasts here. Wait. Oh, Santa Ana was in pits? Ah, yeah. Or something like that. Those sauce are not going to make it. Have you never met Shaw? Literally, have you never met Shaw? The smoothest driver in F3. No one's ever been so smooth. This track just grinds up tires. Yeah, Shaw's moving up. We're keeping an eye. Hopefully, Lee holds him up a little bit. <laughs> Must be your first Shaw stream. So true. He's already a quarter wear. That's because he's pushing. But he's just going to back off. Every race, he does one tire compound softer than we assume anyone could possibly do. And it always works. Just chilling. Five laps of fuel. She has half a tank extra. That's great. Okay, those tires need some heat. Ugh. Dude, <laughs> she's just grinding these tires. Ay, 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 ay. Rafa's got relatively cleaner. Oh, no, he's in third. Oh, no, he's in third. Oh, fuck. <laughs> the animal. Oh, no. Three seconds. 2.9. 2.8. Oh, no. 2.9 again. Huge. 2.8. God. 2.7. Oh, he's setting fastest laps. Oh, no. Oh, no. He is pushing. His tires always make it. Maybe he booms it trying to go for this. Maybe he's shooting for the stars. Uh, do we flag again? 2.1. Oh, my God. Yeah, he's still pushing. Oh, he's going to burn his tires out, actually. Actually, he's going he's gonna to burn his tires. I think we're fine. I think we're so very fine. Two point one. Ah, he's backing off. 
He's backing off. Yes. Softs are 10%. Hards go to zero, which is awesome for us. He can full send on both till the end. Two laps left. She might be able to orange till the end. It'll be close. Oh, uh, yeah, I think we did it. He's got to conserve tires. He tried. He went for the smooth line. I respect the scam bit. The question is, can we get Joseph fastest lap on mediums? I can't imagine we can, right? Even with a light car. He might have stoled. He might have stolen fastest lap from us with that gambit. 2.8. Yeah, three pit Lee. That's how he goes. AJ got a purple. Maybe he can get it right now. But the problem is he's lightening up. What if three pit Lee gets fastest lap, actually? That's not for her, too. Wait, AJ stole fastest lap? Did we get it? We did. We stole fastest lap. Let's go. Hopefully he doesn't take it back. <gasps> AJ went wide! AJ! Oh, he went wide and it didn't matter. <laughs> oh, that's fine. I mean, if he steals fastest lap because of that, that would suck. Because that was our best chance again. That's not even number two behind him. That's number 19. He's actually just flexing. He's doing donuts in the grass. There's one. This one's for you, Staniel Herbert. And on the horizon... There's number two, baby. Let's go. Back-to-back, -back, one, two. Fastest lap pole position. We did keep fastest lap, right? No. Wait, yes. Yes, we did. That's max points. That's max points again. Oh, Lee's on pace for it? Oh, I didn't see. Is he actually? Motherfucker. Come on. Choke. <gasps> traffic. Maybe traffic hurts him. I don't think he got it. Nice. That's max points. This is the best day of racing we've ever had. Holy moly. Two races today. Two poles. Two fastest laps. Two firsts. Two seconds. Whew. Damn. This is what I thought was going to happen in season two. Oh, yeah. Scrutineers. Actually, I forgot. We could get scrutineered. We could get scrutineered for Rafa. Ooh. We should get scrutineered. We've gotten away with it every race this season. <laughs> They'll never catch us. <laughs> Let's go. So good. 0.08 fuel. Yeah, I cal I'll calc the lines, dude. You guys were telling me to save, and I ended up turning it back to orange for a little bit in the middle and back to red at the end. You guys just don't understand the power. Huge, 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 huge. 22 points. They do never check the suspension. Rafa's only 10 points off second now. That's that's good. That's good. That actually, the pole position she got because we had the weather center gambit was really good for her. And now we're up 31 on Lucatelli. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Good races. Oh, YouTube, thank you for watching. Much appreciated. If you're here on Twitch and you've never seen this before and you want to know the lore, exclamation point gaming in the chat. It is youtube.com slash stands but gaming. I have, what, 21, 22 videos of this game. There's a fan fiction. There's a trailer. There's all kinds of insane stuff happening, and I know you're going to like it. I will do some more races maybe tomorrow. We might skip a day on Twitch, twitch.tv slash stands. I'm not sure. But YouTube, I'll see you guys next time.